table, table, table one. Okay, very quickly. Uh, can everybody hear me? Okay, we, we developed a scenario where this is an unusual table, really cool. We have somebody from um, a regional office of ed. We have a parent who's also a small manufacturer employer, and we have a, a high school student. So we had an array of folks, and of course you also have me. I don't know exactly what category I am in. But we wanted to look for a personalized platform so students and teachers could use it uh, if a student was struggling in a particular subject or area, it would provide additional learning resources so the teachers could use it um, to guide the student to, to work on an area where they needed assistance or where they were doing well. We, we emphasized it had to be understandable, easy to access, flexible, and it had to be um, uh, reliable. So we, we assumed a platform delivery that would be very high tech and, and easy. Um, we thought parents should also use it, and we also thought employers should have a way of using it, particularly if they wanted to encourage high school students to take part in internships or a work experiences uh, with companies or employers, even while they're still in high school. Um, we, we are concerned right now, the system is you have to log into separate websites, Teachers use certain ones, parents use others. We were concerned that Google searches often bring up in huge numbers of references that are hard to evaluate, that Wikipedia wasn't that. So we would have to have a very great concern over quality of the resources. Um, and that if, if this was done, it would be widely used. We, um, we thought that additional features would be great, such as video presentations. Students could use the video reports of products of teachers to learn outside of class and spend more time working with and learning in the class on the actual uh, classwork. We call that reverse, at least Alex told us that's called, in high school it's called reverse instruction, and I'm going to start using that in my college courses. So um, we did say the articulation would occur across all P20, and we were concerned that employers weren't actually listed among the institutions, so we added that. Uh, but across all, it would have to be P20 oriented, and that's what we said. Thank you.